MJ the Musical has all the dazzling singing and dancing you'd expect from the life of one of the world's greatest performers. But is there something missing? On hand to celebrate their father's larger-than-life legacy, his daughter Paris Jackson, who hit the red carpet with her brother Prince. Jackson's youngest son, Blanket, was also in attendance. But is it possible to tell the story of Michael Jackson without all the controversy that dogged him in his later years, including allegations of sexually abusing children? Now, the musical was produced with the full cooperation of the Jackson estate, which may explain why it's the glossy life of the pop legend. The first reviews are in, with the New York Times declaring that the musical tells the story of Michael Jackson, except for the big story. Michael Jackson Broadway show sanitizes his life in music, says the New York Post. Christopher Jones is theater lies. critic for the New York Daily know, News. You know, I don't really think it would have worked had it also been addressing those allegations because you would have ended up with a, a sort of a somber drama inevitably. And that's not what they wanted MJ the musical to be. Fans lining up to buy tickets don't seem to care. I don't think we need to hear about the controversies. He was a wonderful icon. One thing the critics agree, Miles Frost, the actor channeling Michael Jackson, is an exciting new talent. Variety calls his performance a stunning feat of likeness and skill. MJ may gloss over the big controversies, but if singing and dancing is what you want, it's what you get. Just